Hi, everyone. Welcome to The Balancing Act. I'm Olga Villaverde. And I'm Amber Melt. Okay, a strong female character. Who's also a princess. Mm, a handsome leading man. A magical genie and a sinister villain. That would be my character, sinister <laughs> villain. <laughs> Gorgeous costumes, iconic music, and show-stopping dance numbers. Can you guess? Mm, it's a favorite of mine that's now on stage. Very exciting. Our Broadway Across America series kicks off with Disney's Aladdin. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, it's one of my favorites. And I got to sit down with the actress playing Jasmine. And I tried my best to tap dance with some of the cast. It is. Did you a dress dance up like number. Jasmine? I was wearing a nice Aladdin t shirt and I was wearing the shoes, but man, is that tough. That I dancing could is show tough. You the oh, I'm not very good. Shimmer. Okay, yeah. Uh -huh. The real one is coming up and she's great. <laughs> I mean, well, you know what? Speaking of things that stink like my tap dance, uh, do you have a signature scent? I do, I love vanilla. I always put candles around and soaps that have vanilla. Just love that. Nice, calming, reminds you of your childhood. Well, today we're gonna learn about um, how to find your signature scent and also maybe your next career. Are you giving me a hint? No, 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 no oh, not okay. yours, but yours. Maybe your next career. <laughs> Thank you for that, right? <laughs> and speaking of things that smell, oh, we've got something yummy cooking in the kitchen, courtesy of Chef Brian. Hi, Ralph. Hi, Brian. Hi, ladies. I'm filling in for Ralph Fagano today, and I know I have some awfully big shoes to fill, but I'm going to make him proud. I'm cooking with the original sliders, and I'm going to show you why the competition is still chasing the best. Well, back to school dinner dilemmas solved. Amazing. Well, let's get the show cooking. Let's do it. The balancing act starts right now. Broadway Balances America brought to you by Broadway Across America, bringing the best of Broadway to a city near you. Time now for Broadway Balances America, our series that takes you behind the scenes of some of the most beloved Broadway musicals as they appear across the country and in your local theaters. Today, we're taking a magic carpet ride with Disney's Aladdin. Oh, one of my favorites. <laughs> and I got to meet some of the stars of the national tour, and I reconfirmed why Jasmine remains one of my favorite princesses ever. Um, I even got to put on a pair of tap shoes thanks to a very talented duo, a brother and sister team, um, though I could have used some help from your girl. Uh, I even discovered a whole new world in this musical that was just magical based on the Academy Award winning Disney animated film. You're glowing, so let's take a look. It's been called pure genius for a reason. Hello, everybody! This new production of Aladdin is filled with unforgettable beauty, magic, comedy, and breathtaking spectacle. It's an extraordinary theatrical event where one lamp and three wishes make the possibilities infinite. Got it. Good. Isabel McCalla's wish came true when she found out she'd be making her national tour debut as the feisty Princess Jasmine. Isabel, we're here in Jasmine's bedroom, and this is oh. like magical. And I've got to be honest, this is like my dream because Jasmine was my princess. Mm -hmm. What is it like to experience this and get to play her in this tour? When I got the call that I was playing Jasmine, it was a lot of high pitched, like, what? <laughs> followed by some incoherent babbling um, and a lot of giggling because when I get excited, I either cry or I giggle. And it was just insane giggling. But it was, I mean, it was pure elation and joy and a dream come true. I can show you the world. Isabel shares many of the same characteristics as her character. I think she leads with her heart and I try to lead with my heart as well. And she is the equal of every, any man and any person in the palace. And she has the smarts and the intuition to fulfill her dreams. And she's truly interested in changing people's minds. That's why she and Aladdin connect so much is because she comes from this palace that she hasn't been able to leave her entire life, and he's been running for his life the entire time and hasn't found an ability to find a home. Water flows under the bridge, let it pass, let it go. Luckily, when they find each other, they have a meeting of the minds, and then they can find home in each other, you know, through adventure and through magic. 
You know, this is not a kid show. This is like a great show for adults to come to. Absolutely, and it's perfect for those of us who grew up with the movie because I think also in this stage production, not only do we have these new songs written by Alan Menken and Howard Ashman and Chad Beglin, but the story is more in depth and it's um, more grounded. And I think you get to fall in love a little more with the story and the characters because of that. And that multi-award winning creative team has made Disney magic, a visual and musical extravaganza from the staging to the handmade costumes designed by Tony-winning costume designer Greg Barnes. There are um, over 300 costumes in this show, which is about 100 more than any other Disney production, which is pretty insane. And also there's um, over 100 costume changes that happen in less than a minute during one of the numbers. So there is as much choreography backstage as there is on stage to make it all happen. <laughs> The fabrics, they look so authentic. These fabrics are pulled from co um, countries from Morocco, Turkey, Uzbekistan, China, Guatemala, Italy, England, basically to make this seem like this beautiful melting pot of cultures in Agrabah. So let's talk about some of your costumes. Now, do yes. you have a favorite? Well, I have to say that Jasmine Daywear is the most, the blue two-piece, because it makes me feel the most like a Disney princess. It is a classic look. It's her classic but look. But I also have to say that my wedding, it's so fantastic, and this skirt weighs actually 12 pounds because of all the crystal beading on it. Oh, it's gorgeous. So, Which is yeah. like most wedding dresses, I feel like, so heavy. We'll be the beauty of the show isn't limited to the costumes, it's also reflected in the set. So I feel like I've died and gone to heaven, but really we're just here in the Cave of Wonders. I'm here with Matthew and Lissa de Guzman. You guys are both swings here in the show. Yep. So before we even get into this, for people who might not know, what is a swing? Ooh. Well, a swing, we like to call it the safety net of the company or like the superheroes of the company. So I cover seven girl tracks and I understudy Jasmine and- I cover 11 male tracks, which includes two featured characters in the ensemble. And so if any of them need to call out for whatever reason, um, we are there to swing in, which is why we're called swings, at any moment. We both have tracking sheets for the individual tracks that we cover, and mm -hmm. so you know exactly where you need to enter, where you need to exit, what prop you need to pick up, and the biggest mm -hmm. thing for us is if people don't notice that we're on, that's when we know we did our job. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so having roles that are so um, physically intense and mentally intense, how do you stay prepared for them? Sleep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> definitely a lot of sleep and reviewing a lot. It's definitely all about balance, but we do like, you have to eat well to perform mm -hmm. well, you have to go to the gym, you have to be ready at a moment's mm -hmm. notice. And now, Alyssa, this is your first national yes. tour, but you've done them before, Matthew. Yes. So, do you turn to your big brother for advice here? Absolutely. <laughs> I feel spoiled rotten because I can ask him any question from the dumbest question to the most intense question <laughs> and he'll have an answer for me and I can always trust that he'll give me the straight up answer yeah. too. <laughs> yeah. Not that I exactly know what's going on, but <laughs> what, in my experience, what we've done before. We're in this Cave of Wonders and I hear that you guys are going to teach me to tap dance? Yeah. Okay, safe you space, right? Absolutely. Three wishes. What will I wish for next? Okay, so I'm here with Michael Callahan. You're the dance captain. I am. The numbers in this show are ginormous and they are incredible. I yes. mean, so what do you think you can teach me here as a new tap? So the only tap lingo we're gonna start with is called a shuffle. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. <laughs> da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Close, close, okay. close, close, close. So we're going step, shuffle, step, 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 shuffle, step, step. Oh wait, I messed up. That's okay, that's okay. <laughs> Again, here we go. Step, shuffle, step, 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 shuffle, oh! step, step. Oh, cool. <laughs> step, shuffle, step, 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 shuffle, step, 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 shuffle, step, 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 shuffle, step, step, walk, walk, run, 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 pose. I'm killing it back here. Yeah, I mean, from what I saw, awesome. <laughs> like... All right, so as fun as this has been, and Michael and crew, thank you so much, I think I'm gonna let the pro show you how it's really done. And 
that's some terrific tapping. Thank you so much. Thank Absolutely. you guys all. That was yeah. awesome. Yeah. <laughs> The whole show is truly magical, and they can't wait for audiences across the country to experience it for themselves. I want them to have a wonderful escape from whatever's going on in their lives. Just, just come here and laugh a lot and look at the beautiful colors and the detailed costumes and the amazing set pieces and scenes and all that. And just enjoy this romantic love story between two young adults. I would love for people to leave this show with a sense of hope and inspiration in the sense that you should not feel defined by your circumstances or defined by your monetary wealth or the materialistic aspects. I would hope that I could inspire some women to realize their full potential and to go out and say, I can absolutely become a doctor or a, a pilot or I could run a country because what's wrong with a woman running the kingdom? There's absolutely nothing wrong. So I'd hope that people leave with a sense of possibility. The North American tour of Aladdin is coming soon to a theater near you. Check out Broadway Across America, Broadway Balances America, or you can always go to our website, thebalancingact.com, for all the show information, tour dates, and more. You know, not everyone has a nine to five job, nor should they. You know, loving what you do and making a living at the same time, well, that's the sweet smell of success. Yeah, I would say that doesn't stink. We got to spend the day with Georgina Schwery. Now, she works with one of the world's largest direct sellers of candles and accessories. I love candles. Oh, yes, who doesn't love those candles? To find out what it's like to be a party light consultant. Check this out. I'm Georgina Schwery, and I've been a party light consultant for 12 years. Today, I have a brunch and candles party at 11 a.m. Jamie is going to have so much fun with her guests, and it's great, because I get to be in business for myself, but not by myself. It's getting ready for my party. This is the glamorous life of a party light consultant. Georgina. Hi, Georgina. I just wanted to let you know that I'm on my way. I'll see you in about 15 minutes. Great. I'm so excited for a party. Me too. I'll see you soon. People ask me all the time, do you really make money selling candles? Yes. This isn't just part-time moms making some extra income. There are people out there having their own full-time party light business, and dads do it too. You get to choose when you want to work your business. That's the best part. The flexibility and the freedom is yours. The sky is the limit. Okay, let's do this. Hi! Hi, hey girl, how are you? Thank you. Yes, so glad to see Great you. To are you ready for your party today? I'm so excited. It's about helping people find the fragrance that brings them back to a special time in their life or a memory and creates a journey for them. They get to choose how their home is going to be decorated with decor and fragrance to fit their lifestyle. Not only do I get to debut the brand new autumn line with Party Light, I get to share our brand new concept of finding your signature with our fragrance crayons. There are 24 fragrances, and my favorite combo is the mulberry and the cinnamon woods. And so then what you will do is you'll find, you'll grab both of your fragrances and your fragrance type of mm -hmm. choice, whether it be the sticks or the jars or the tea lights, and you're going to burn or melt each of those fragrances. And then when they fill the room, that is your signature fragrance. Oh. So like right there, you have two different scents that are burning at the same time. That's what's creating the combination of the two crayons. Exactly. So when someone comes into your home, they're gonna be like, Jamie, what is that smell? You'd be like, that is my <laughs> signature fragrance with party. <laughs> Light. And then your fragrance is going to be different as well. Mm -hmm. The cool thing is, is they come in our melts, they come in our smart scent sticks, which these are fabulous. Whether you have your personal leader to help guide you every step of the way, we also have an amazing online training program that you can watch any time of the day to fit your schedule. There's no cost, none. 
I know, people say it's hard to believe, but seriously, I started this business 12 years ago, no cost. Today was a really great day. I mean, really great day. I was able to choose when I wanted to party with Jamie and her friends for brunch and candles, able to give Jamie a free shopping spree and share the business opportunity with her. So not only are we meeting this week to discuss more about how she can have her own party light business, I get to see them again within another week because Sherry is hosting her own party. So Sherry gets to experience the same thing that Jamie's experiencing and they all loved finding their signature fragrance with our new collection. Time to get in the kitchen and cook with Chef Brian Tyrell. Mm-hmm, he's serving up some bite-sized burgers from White Castle, hello. Oh. oh yeah, love that. They're big on taste, they're easy on the preparation, they're square, so they're fun. I'm not square, but those are square. Oh yeah, so <laughs> back to school, dinner dilemmas solved. The only thing better than a burger is several tiny burgers called sliders. I'm Brian Terrell and welcome to my kitchen. Today we're cooking with the original slider and I'm gonna show you how to go gourmet with White Castle burgers. Let's get started. White Castle sliders are made from 100% USDA inspected beef. White Castle has been a family owned restaurant since 1921. They have nearly 400 restaurants and retail stores nationwide. I remember growing up in the Midwest, our family used to pack into the station wagon and our father always told us that if we were good, we got to go to White Castle. Now, White Castle is available in the freezer section of your grocery aisle. And people have been so excited about that, they have come up with their own burger toppings. They have jalapenos on there, they have bacon, they have avocado, they have pineapple. It's to the point where people have taken it even further and started sending in recipes for their favorite restaurants using White Castle hamburgers. Among those is this nice quiche dish that's got White Castle burgers in there. It's got cheese, it's got spinach. We also have these really nice stuffed peppers that's got White Castle burgers in there. And you know what? These sliders make a great snack too. These burgers are steam grilled over a bed of onions, just like the restaurants. White Castle hamburgers are cooked, packaged, and flash frozen that duplicate the unique steam grilling process. And these great burgers take just a minute in the microwave. Now, what I like to do is take my White Castle burgers and make some quesadillas. What we're gonna do is we'll take a little bit of oil, Spread that on there on both sides of that. This is all 100% beef and is so good. It, they actually cook this with, with sweet onions on there. It gives us such a great, wonderful flavor. Then we're gonna take some of these mushrooms and onions and put that right on top there. Then we're gonna take some really fresh cheese, put that on top. And then we're gonna take this topping, put it on there put it right into the oven for about 15 minutes at 350 degrees till it gets a really nice color on there. Just look at that nice golden brown. And while that's cooling off, I'm gonna make a little bit of a salsa to go with that. We're gonna take some tomatoes, some red onion, some cilantro, of course some jalapenos, and some lime juice. Then we're gonna take our spoon, mix that all in together, just make a really nice salsa to go on top of that. Now our quesadilla is cooled off enough to where we can actually handle it. I'm gonna take that, slice it into four pieces, put some of this salsa right on top of that. I can't wait to try this. Mm. Find these sliders at your freezer section of your grocery store or go to whitecastle.com or our website, thebalancingact.com. Don't forget to share your favorite recipe with us. So one of the coolest things about Aladdin though is it wasn't parents and their children. There was a lot of people. Oh right? yeah. Yeah, I mean these are like, I guess it's because we grew up with Aladdin. And Disney is for every. Everyone, and when that magic carpet took off, I gotta tell you, I kept asking, how does it happen, how does it happen? Did you get on the carpet? They, no, and they wouldn't tell me. Disney magic, <laughs> I mean, that thing really flew. I gotta take my girls, you'll come with us? Yes, I definitely it's will. It's an invite. It was magical. Oh, I love it. And for more magic in your life, you can always go to our Facebook page and our website, and of course, you can follow us on Twitter, because we've got lots more there. See how she did that? We're just gonna dance into our Thanks dance. for watching, everyone. <laughs> we'll see you next time.